I find it disappointing that when someone says something like this about Sargon of Akkad, basically saying, you know, hey, you can't make a hate case for Hillary without mentioning Trump. She only becomes acceptable in context of juxtaposition to the buffoon. I'm personally tired of Sargon's one-sided coverage. I unsubscribed but come back occasionally to see if he can muster up the courage to stand up to his right-wing audience and say something bad about their god king. He can't. He's sacrificed his intellectual honesty. And I tend to agree with that. In fact, I'm going to go like this. Um, and Sargon replies with, Well, I've never said Trump will be a good candidate, and you can get anti-Trump coverage 24-7 on any mainstream media outlet. I'm not wasting my time making something that will be obvious and unfunny. Well, I think that tells everyone uh, everything they need to know. You know, this sort of shit, this sort of one-sided shit where all he wants to do is pander to right-wingers, that's why I am not subscribed to him. Um, so yeah, Sargon, uh, if you're not a right-winger, why do you only pander to them? Hillary is indeed messed up. Hillary is indeed a warmonger, but Trump isn't fit to be president. Trump will fuck up this country. But you don't, you don't want to mention that because, well, then that might make people vote for Hillary. So you're willing to let your biases get in the way of intellectual honesty. And that's sad. And that's been the thing that you've done almost the whole time. And you've never gotten any better at it. In fact, this is showing that you're getting worse at it. Have fun with that, sweetheart.